Yo, what's good, everybody? Dust for Kicks here. Welcome back to the channel. Today we have the Jordan 3 Black Cement. Let's go ahead and check out. Alright guys, so this pair comes from DW Sneakers, information with all their links and discount code right here on the screen, so you can go ahead and check them out. The first things first, we have the box, it is not a very special box, it's one we've seen plenty of times before, it is the Jordan 3 box, black on top with the Jumpman in red, all around the sides you have the little elephant print right there in black and gray. As far as accessories go, it did not come with any extra laces, but it did come with the really cool little clear and orange Nike AirTag. Getting into the actual shoes, starting with the ankle collar, you have this perforated gray leather. Then it goes down into a soft black tumbled leather. You can see it goes in really easily with just a soft touch, so it's gonna be nice and comfortable. You have the perforated gray leather here, the little black accents for the lace guard, little red accents here. You have a smooth black leather trim right there. You have the elephant print, which in my opinion is pretty much the most important thing about a three between rep and retail. Now, we've seen a lot of different variants of the elephant print these years, but this is really, really nice for the 2018 version of the shoe. A lot of the reps that you see are really, really thick print, and some of them recently have been even really, really thin. This is on par with retail. Then it goes down into a nice black kind of matte for the midsole. Then it goes to like a creamy white, then white here. And then around the toe box, you also have the elephant print once again. You have the air bubble down here clear with the white right there. Also, we're met with that cement gray with the red hit here, as well as the Nike red hit here, and then a little bit of white. Coat of the toe box, just like the side panels, you have the nice tumbled black leather. You have the perforated gray for the tongue. Black lace is by default. The tongue, like I said, is gray. Jumpman logo right there in red. Coming to the inside of the shoe, you have a nice soft gray sock liner. Insole is red with Nike Air and the swoosh on top there in black. You can see the back of the tongue is also a nice comfy padded red. Back side of the shoe, you still have that matte black right here for the midsole. You have the nice elephant print with a pretty decent cut in my opinion, not too sloppy or anything. You have the air right there in white, as well as Nike and the swoosh in white on top of that black leather heel tab. And once again, I don't know about the TikTok people, but it's a pretty sturdy tab. Medial side to finish it all off, you still have the gray perforated leather here, as well as here. You have the tumbled soft black leather that just looks like it's gonna be pretty comfy. And then you have the really nice elephant print that, like I said, for a 2018 version, this is pretty on point there, as well as around the toe box. All right, guys, so these are arguably the most iconic Jordan 3 colorway to ever exist, even to this day. Now, I believe they originally released in 88, which is several years before even I was born. So we've had reps of the Black Cement 3s for a good while now, but for the most part, at least when it came to the elephant print, they were shit. For the most part, they were just completely too thick on the elephant print and you could see it from a mile away you could just tell and a lot of the newer batches you'll see have a really thin print kind of like we saw on the retail for the white cement 3 reimagined that came out earlier this year now they've gotten it to where it's this nice medium print which i think is the best when comparing it to retail you can have a little bit thicker than this but not as thick and not as the direction of the actual elephant print goes really nicely on this one some of the ones just look too I don't even know what the term, I'll put a picture on the screen of what I'm talking about if I can find it while editing the video. But the whole black upper is just easy to style and then you have the nice hits of the cement gray all over and the hits of the red, which is my favorite color. You even have the Nike Air on the back. These are just great and I'm really stoked that they're in my collection now. All right guys, I think that's it for me today. Just like always, I really appreciate you guys coming over to the channel and hanging out for a bit. Till next time, I'm Dustin for Kicks, peace.